my name is Kayla Huntington. I have been an educator for four years and I am currently a seventh and eighth grade life skills teacher with the Shemokin Area School District. I consider myself to be a passionate, nurturing, meticulous, and knowledgeable special educator who is dedicated to advocating for students and families, making a difference in my students' lives, and creating a positive and engaging environment to foster learning and student growth. I've been able to do what I love for the past four years, and I've reached personal achievements like obtaining my master's degree in education while teaching through the COVID-19 pandemic as a first year teacher. Teaching through the pandemic is definitely an experience I will never forget, but it has also helped to shape the educator that I am today. Some other personal achievements are that I've attained tenure, I've helped to mentor incoming faculty, and I worked along with faculty and staff to host our first ever inclusion day. During my time at Shimokan, I've worked diligently alongside the high school life skills faculty and students in a cafe called the Purple Perk, which is run out of the school library. This year, I was able to successfully take over three class periods with my seventh and eighth grade students, where I was able to supervise them while they demonstrated what they've learned. This unique opportunity has provided me with the ability to teach my students valuable independent living skills with a hands-on approach while simultaneously incorporating core academics like reading, writing, and math. Along with the opportunities for my students to be involved in the Purple Perk, I've also collaborated with the Autistic Support Classroom and Multiple Disabilities Classroom to create a newspaper route for our students, along with participate in dress down day collections, building wide for the students to practice social skills and also gain independence on navigating the building. Over the past four years, I have had the absolute pleasure to advocate for and teach students of different backgrounds and abilities, such as English language learners, students with cerebral palsy and ADHD, students with traumatic brain injuries, students with intellectual disabilities, learning disabilities, and autism. I've also been successful with including my students within the regular education setting in a meaningful and rewarding way with the support of the regular education teachers. While my experiences have been teaching in a middle school life skills classroom, I do believe I can adapt with ease to an elementary life skills setting. I have a great understanding of the importance to teach functional and vocational skills at an early age while incorporating core academics. For students to be successful academically and socially, it is essential they have access to a positive and well-organized environment at a young age. Specifically, an elementary life skills classroom should be a well-organized and structured environment that also allows flexibility of student needs with clearly defined spaces and labels where necessary. Another important attribute is student and staff schedules. Student schedules should be visually appealing with activities clearly represented and students should be taught how to use it. Staff also require a schedule so that they know what is expected of them and also when and where they are to report. A reinforcement system is also necessary to motivate students and promote success. It would be an absolute honor to be a member of the SCA team. I'm a 2012 graduate from Southern and I thoroughly appreciate and cherish all of my experiences and education. Some of my fondest memories consist of being a member of Tiger News and also playing soccer. But when I think back to my time at Southern, the first thing that comes to mind always are the tremendous educators, mentors, and coaches I had. Those individuals are the core reason I wanted to become a teacher in the first place. To be a part of Southern is a part of a community that is a family. You look after one another, you support each other, and you always want what is best for your students even after they graduate and move on with their lives. I believe that my passion for teaching, specialized knowledge and experience, and past history as a Southern Tiger make me a strong candidate for this position. I truly thank you so much for your time and consideration. Please reach out to me if you have any questions, and I look forward to meeting with you in person. Thank you.